Skincare care brand InnoHerb is one of the domestic companies that uses only plants as the major ingredients of its products. Sales have bloomed in recent years. The sales volume of its most popular product, Rediola Rosia Serum, grew 10 times in 2018, compared to the previous year. The company says it has a very special crop of customers. Our consumers have a higher educational level, and they have higher demands for effective products. They are aware of their skin conditions and know what problems they need to solve. InnoHerb is far from the only skincare brand that are using natural plant products to attract consumers. Smaller sized doctor plant has been flourishing, and now has over 3,000 stores in 300 cities. Then there is Lin Qingxuan which has sold over 380,000 bottles of camellia oil in the past year. It turns out Chinese consumers are very conscious about the ingredients in what they put on their skin. I focus on the effects and the ingredients to make sure I won't have an allergic reaction. My skin is oily and I have acne, so I focus more on oil control and moisturizing ingredients. I think pure nature is better. Data from research company Kanta World Panel show that over 16% of Chinese consumers spending on skincare products goes to plant-based products. The shopping basket Chinese consumers hold is becoming larger, but these baskets don't necessarily just contain more high-end products, but rather more diverse products. Botanical skincare products are an easy addition to the baskets. Domestic brands now dominate in the botanical skincare shelves, with two-thirds of the products on the sale coming from Chinese firms. But experts point out that foreign brands are finding a place in the garden. Kenta World Panel data show the sales value of botanical products from Japanese and European skincare sprouted over 50% a year on year from April 2018 to March 2019. Japanese brands and Europe and U.S. brands have many effective products. For example, they use ingredients like basil and mushroom to tackle problems of acne, and that is impacting the performance of domestic brands. Still, domestic brands have reacted quickly, and they have been able to latch on to market trends such as using technology, new refined oil products, and derivative products. Herboroist, for example, has opened a skincare spa in Shanghai, while other brands, including InnoHerb and Dr. Plant, have started to work with universities to ensure their investments in ingredients research will bear fruit. Chen Tong is for CGTN, Shanghai.